What's going on with you YouTube? Jumpman Chris here. We come back at y'all with another vid. We're in the car vlog all the way to the mall vlog. Guess what we got here today? Special guest. We got, he got kicks up in the buildings. What's good, bro? What up? What up? But he's here to keep me company because first today was the release of the Silver Toes. Now, I just want to say is, yes, I did get a W on the Snickers app. Just get a W. No. You didn't get any W, sorry. No. So, look, look, in my local area with these silver toes, basically they were like impossible. They're like nowhere to be found. Like they were like two, three stores. Yeah, like two or three stores only had them, bro. And some of these, like I think it was like some Hibis and City Gears were doing first come, first serve. And I was like, you know, with everything going on, I really wasn't about that. And I knew some drama was going to happen. So, wasn't feeling that. And which is kind of is with my content like i gotta grind and try to find a pair for release day so i can go and you know make that vlog and everything and the pair that i got from stinkers that wasn't exactly my size i went for a size 10 i really need a size 11 or size 10 and a half i just figured that a size 10 would be more pairs of those because this is a women exclusive shoe but anyways um shout out to my boy not your average sneaker head man he hit me up he lives in Cincy. he said he got a w and I was like, you know what, man? I really need this content. I need to come pick this up. I'm really not about this drama to about doing some first come first serve and camping out and all that stuff. Like, I really didn't want to do that. Plus, with well, all the snow and coldness and everything, nah, I'm good. So, I'm going to go up to Cincy, which is about a 90-minute drive. And that shows you all the dedication. That shows you all the dedication. See? I just want to show you guys, like, that's my dedication to get this uh, content and vlog out and pick up this pair. And because like if I if I didn't get this pair today, that would have been it. I, I couldn't I wouldn't have anything to show. I would have nothing to do. You know what I mean? Like I just try to put as you know much effort and much grind as I possibly can, man. And but anyways, we're gonna meet up with uh, not your ever sneakerhead. We're gonna go up. I think he got a W at corporate or something. But hey, hopefully we get a pair. We'll get, we'll get it and we'll be good to go. Hopefully they let me vlog. I did see a good amount of W's on sneakers. But like I said, like locally and in stores, I think it was almost damn near impossible. Like, cause with all the shipment delays and all the weather conditions and stuff like that, it was just, it was getting, it's getting bad guys. Like I'm, I'm noticing it too. I get it. A lot of people's getting frustrated with how things are. And you know, I feel it, man. I, and I, I, and I get it. Like it's, it's not like how it used to be, you know, back in 2019, 18, like it was easy to get W's. Now it's like, you gotta work extra, extra hard, and that's what I want to show to you guys. Even if I do take all ills around my local area, I still gotta drive out, either go to like Indy, Cincy, or where the case is, just so I can go ahead and make this content, guys. So. spot here in Columbus there's a homie Tony what's good bro what's good oh big homie here not your average sneakerhead all right are we just what it what's the what's how does, how does this work I'm about to call him right now I'll go up to the door and pick him up and I'll bring him over to you okay I'll just kind of just chill right here then all right I right, appreciate you bro no problem. like some type of um curbside pickup only no one goes inside the shop or whatever but all right let's get it we we think alike, bro. You know what I'm right. saying? Hey, they're, they're good winter shoes. <laughs> exactly, for sure. Damn, y'all got hit with some snow. Yeah, let me go grab them real quick. All right, go ahead, cool. So he's gonna go ahead. He's gonna go ahead and grab the pair, while I'm just I'm gonna buy it off of him. And he's looking out for me, and I appreciate that, bro. So Tony coming through with the bag, man. Yes, sir. Thank you, thank you, bro. I ended up with like five pair of these. Did you? Yeah. So I mean, Atmos here. Can I get the bag? Of course. Oh, nice. Yeah, just take that. Take that. 
Get the bag. Damn, let me get this bag. This is actually pretty nice. Right, let's take a look at this thing. Through. I already drive all the way to Cincy. Come here with my guy. Hold up. Let me pull it up. There we go. With my guy, uh, not your average sneakerhead, Tony. What's up? Good dude, man. We've been talking back and forth all the time. Good people, man. Good, Good people. people, bro. Look at that. Oh. Nice, nice. All right, bro. I appreciate it. Thank you for looking out for me, man. Yes, sir. All right, you know if I can cash up you? Yeah. Boys, come help me out, bro. I need help, please. I can't do this thumbnail. Yeah, it's deep. No, I got it, I got it, I got it. Of course, is it worth it to drive out here for these? Um, I do like it. What do you think, though? Let's keep it 100. Oh, shit, this is dirty, but I brought the shadows out because they're kind of similar-ish. No. No. <laughs> I think I would probably look at those like, let me see them real quick. I think these things are, would I put this the same, would I put this at the same category as like say, the gold toes, you know? Probably not, man. Mm -mm. I'm afraid this is gonna like flake off. You think so? After a few wears. I don't Let's think I'll do all that. This laces is ridiculous though. You know, it reminds me of like, the Tin Man from Wind Winter Wizards, <laughs> or uh, the Wizard of Oz. Wizard of Oz. <laughs> That's what it reminds me of. But I still think it's, it's a fire color blocking though, you know? Yeah, they did it right, but... For sure. We're at the only shop here. This is Dead Stock. I believe that's what it's called. And it's like a sneaker store. It's supposed to be a grand opening tomorrow. I'm, I'm gonna try to pop up and, you know, uh, come in when they do a, their grand opening. But I had to come in today. Check Don't out the day. shop. Woo! Check out my guy Chase. This is from Deadstock Ammo's. Man, they're gonna have a grand opening tomorrow. What up, appreciate, guys? Appreciate yes, you guys. Sir, man. Let me get a little quick peek, and I'm gonna try to make it out here tomorrow, man. They look like there's gonna be some good uh, grand opening, maybe some good deals and steals or whatever. But how are you having the shot, man? Appreciate I knew you were gonna do it, man. For appreciate real. Appreciate it, man. Absolutely. It's been a long time coming for sure. You want to just shout your spot out real quick? Yeah. So it's uh, you can follow us on Instagram. It's Deadstock Cebus. That's dead stock and then CBUS. So All right. Follow us on Instagram there. We'll be on Facebook. Sheesh. You guys get these down there? No, bro. I think like maybe Hibbits and City Gears, but they were doing first come, first serve. Alright, we just went to the homie spot real quick. Just chop it up. What do you think of the shop, man? Pretty dope. We had a dope spot. Yeah, dope spot. It's a good location, bro. And he hooked it up, man. So appreciate you, Chase, brother. And yeah, so I think we're going to head back home. Try to find something to eat and then we'll be done with the Starving. day. Starving. <laughs> you hungry? Yeah, I'm yeah, hungry too, bro. Let's go. All right, finally back at the crib, man. So, like I said, now shout out to my guy, Not Your Average Sneakerhead, on YouTube. If you guys want to follow him, please and subscribe. But this pair here is going to be my personal. This is my size. Woof. And yeah, man. And uh, one size that I did get on sneakers, I got a W on. I believe that was a size either. I think that was a seven and a half or an eight. I think it was an eight because I knew usually around that size, especially for a women's shoe, not many people really go for that size because it's not really like the money size. So it's a little bit easier to get. And that's the size I kind of went for. And I got a W on that. So stay tuned for the whole sneakers app and stuff like that. But yeah, man. So um, do you guys want me to do, uh, should I do a hold and sell on these things? And that, you know, I know some people have been DMing me about it. And, you know, it's been a while since we had, like, an Air Jordan 1. Like, at least a decent good Air Jordan 1 drop. I believe the last Air Jordan 1 drop, well, except for, you know, uh, this is actually a, a decent one that some people could touch. But still, it was really tough out there. I've seen a lot of drama out of lately, man. It's been, whew, guys, just just be safe out there, man. At the end of the day, it's, still, it's just sneakers, but still, I do get it. I understand. I get the frustration, guys. I truly, truly do. It sucks, and... I just hope things get better, man. I really, really do. All right. Anyway, guys, that's pretty much in of the video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys don't mind, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if it's your first time here. Comment down below, and please hit that bell for all the notifications for when I do drop vids. And don't forget to follow me on all my social media at GermanChris on IG. Sometimes I'm on Twitter. And don't forget Snapchat. Anyway, guys, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. Thank you guys so, so much. I'm GermanChris. Peace.